Everyone on your back in Shavasana. Lying down on the back. Legs apart and the arms apart. Relax the legs. Relax the back. Relax the arms. And the shoulders. Relax the neck, head and the face. Soften the eyes, relax the forehead. Relax the jaw, relax the ears. Mentally scan the body and let go the tension from the whole body. Become aware of the mind. Slow down the thoughts. Calm down your feelings. Bring the awareness to the breath. Slow down the breath. and feel the changes taking place in the mind. <clears throat> Make your breath long and deep. Every inhalation, the body expanding. And every exhalation, allow the body to sink down. Inhalation, bringing you lots of fresh energy. Each cell of the body getting charged with fresh oxygen. And every exhalation carrying away with it some tiredness, some tension. Keep breathing. Take a deep breath, bring your legs together, interlock your fingers, stretch your arms over the head, stretch your whole body, move the toes forward and move the toes in. Press your floor back down on the mat, stretch the body. Release the stretch, bend the knees, turn over to one side and please sit up. Let's turn the prayer. Sit up straight, close your eyes and concentrate. Oh, 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 Umasutam Shokavinashikarnam Namami Vigni Shurapadi Pankajam Sharananam Kumkumarapta Varnam 
महामतिम दिव्य मयूर वाहन रुद्र से सुनम सुर सैन्यनाथम कुहम सदाहम शरण प्रपते या कुंदेन्दु तुषार हार तबुरा या शुभ्र वस्त्रावृता या भीना वरदंड मंडित करा या श्वेत पद्मासना या ब्रह्मा चुत शंकर प्रवृत्ति बेर देव सदा पूजिता समाम पादु सरस्वती भगवती निशेष जड़िया पहा ओम नम शिवाय गुरुवे सचिदानंद मूर्त निष्प्रपंचाय शांताय श्री शिवानंदय ते नम श्री विष्णु देवानंदय ते नम ओम सर्व मंगल मंगले शिवे सर्वार्थ साधिके शरण्ये त्र्यंबके गौरी नारायणी नमोस्तुते नारायणी नमोस्तुते शांति 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 ओम शिवाय एंड वेलकम टू एवरीवन लेट्स गेट रेडी फॉर द प्रैक्टिस Please stand up. We begin with sun salutation. Come to the top of your mat. We'll go slow in the first round. Feet together. Let's take two deep breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now join the hands. to the chest in prayer position inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale stretch your body forward and down inhale the right leg back right knee down look up hold the breath lift leg back body in a straight line exhale knees down but except just between the hands fold it or chin down Inhale, slide forward, arch back into cobra. Exhale, tuck the toes, lift the buttocks up in vajra V. Look to the toes. Inhale, the right leg forward between the hands, left knee down, look up. Exhale, the left leg forward, press your hands down. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up, arch back and look up. Exhale, release. Inhale. And exhale, prayer position. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back. Exhale, knees, chest, and the forehead down. Inhale, slide forward, arch back. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward between the hands. Look up. Exhale, the right leg forward. Press your hands down. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up, arch back, and look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Inhale, and exhale. Prayer position. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back. Look up. Hold the breath. Lift it back. Exhale. Knees, chest, and the forehead down. Inhale. Slide forward. Arch back. Exhale. Inverted V. Inhale. The right leg forward. Look up. Exhale. The left leg forward. Press your hands down. Inhale. Stretch forward. Stretch up. Arch back and look up. Exhale. Release your position. Left side. Inhale and exhale. Prayer position. Inhale. Stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale. Stretch your body forward and down. Inhale. The left leg back. Look up. Hold the breath. Right leg back. Exhale. Knees, chest, and the forehead down. Inhale. Slide forward. Arch back. Exhale. Inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward. Look up. Exhale, the right leg forward. Press your hands down. Inhale, lengthen your body forward. Stretch up, arch back, and look up. Exhale, release. Third round. Inhale and exhale. Prayer position. 
Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch your body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up, stay there. Push the right leg more back if possible. Stretch your chin more up. Breathe. Now tuck the right toes in, take the left leg back, body in a straight line. Tuck the abdomen in, shoulders right on top of the wrist. Strong arms, strong shoulders, strong body. Slowly exhale. Drop the knees down, keep the buttocks lifted up, chest between the hands, forehead or chin down on the mat. Eight parts of the body touching down and weight is equally distributed on these eight parts. Inhale, slide your body forward, arch back into cobra. Relax the shoulders away from the ears and lift the upper body more up, feel the pressure on the lower abdomen. As you exhale, tuck the toes, lift your buttocks up. Look to the toes, inverted V. Breathe, push the heels down and press the hands down. Tuck the abdomen in. Head and upper arms in line. Push the chest down towards the mat. The next inhalation, bring your right foot forward between the hands and push the left leg more back, look up. Breathe. And on the exhalation, bring the left leg forward. Press the hands down, shift your body weight forward. Chest close to the thighs, forehead close to the knees, top of the head reaching down. Knees can be bent or knees can be straight. Inhale, slide your body forward. Come up, arch back, push your buttocks forward. Look up to the hands and exhale, release. Left side, inhale and exhale, prayer position. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch your body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, slide forward, arch back. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward, press your hands down. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up, arch back and look up. Exhale, release. Fourth round, inhale and exhale, prayer position. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back into the plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, slide forward, arch back into cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the right leg forward, look up. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up, arch back and look up. Exhale, release. If you've just joined, make sure that you take rest in Shavasana for a few breaths and then come up for sun salutation. Left side, inhale and exhale, prayer position. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, slide forward, arch back. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward, press down. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up, arch back, look up. And exhale, release. Fifth round, inhale and exhale, breath position. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch your body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the right leg forward, look up. Exhale, the left leg forward, press down. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up, arch back, look up. Exhale, release. 
Left side, inhale and exhale prayer position. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch your body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath right. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted wheel. Inhale, the left leg forward, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward, press your hands. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up, arch back and look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Last round, inhale and exhale, palms to the chest and rear. Inhale, lengthen up and arch back. Exhale, lengthen forward and reach down. Inhale, the right leg all the way back, look up. Hold the breath into the plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the right leg forward, look up. Exhale, the left leg forward, press down. Inhale, lengthen forward, reach up, arch back, push your buttocks forward, and look up. Exhale, release. Inhale. And exhale, prayer position. Inhale, arms apart, back. Exhale, stretch your body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg all the way back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up, arch back and look up. Exhale, release. That's very good. Separate your legs apart, take a breather. Relax the body. And please sit down and lie down on your back in Shavasana arms apart and the legs apart, relax. Consciously slowing the breath down. Pause for a while after inhalation and pause for a while after the exhalation. Mentally scan the body from toes to the head. Release all the tension, all the tightness. Once the breath is calmed down, allow the body to sink down with gravity. Absorbing all the energy into the body by relaxing, by relaxing with gravity. The entire asana practice depends on the practice of sun salutation. More you stretch in sun salutation, better is the practice, the asana practice. Take a deep inhalation, bring your legs together, interlock your fingers, stretch your arms over the head and stretch the whole body. Release the stretch, preparing for the single leg raises, arms close to the body, palms facing down, bring the chin towards the chest, feet together, toes pointing up. Inhale, stretch your right leg up, go as far up with the leg as the knee remains straight. Exhale, release the leg down. Left leg up, inhale. Exhale down. Right leg up, inhale. 
Exhale down. Left leg up, inhale. Exhale down. Now right leg up, inhale. Hold the right thigh and pull the leg closer to the body. Try to straighten the knee if possible. And on the exhalation, lift your head up, chest up. Come up. Relax the shoulders and the neck. Breathe deep into the abdomen and push the left thigh down towards the floor. And slowly exhale, bring the head down, chest down. Bend the knee to the chest, hug it tightly. And now hold the leg in your arms, just as you do for the rocking baby. Move the leg into the chest. If you've joined today after a long gap for the first class, please watch the screen whenever you have doubt. Now lift your head up, chest up, come up. Breathe. Hold the foot or the toes and push the knee away from the body, moving the foot up towards the head. Head or the forehead. Understand your body. Try not to struggle. Go with the breath. Slowly exhale, release the head down. Now hold the right toes with your right hand and stretch your right leg with the right side of your body. So just do what is good for you. Try to straighten the knee as much as possible and push the left body down towards the floor. Your left arm is in line with the left shoulder. You can keep the head in the center or turn the head to the left. So the right knee is straight and the left hip is pushing down. If by holding the right toes, your knee bends, you can hold the back of the right thigh with your right hand. More you push the left body down, more you work on the hip joint. Inhale, raise the right leg up and change the position of your hands. Holding the right big toe with your left hand and right arm stretching out on the exhalation, bring your right leg down to the left side. So instead of the toes, if you feel like holding anywhere else, you can do that just to be more comfortable. Hold the back of the thigh or hold the calf. Move the left leg more up and keep the left knee straight uh, and the right knee straight. Push the right shoulder down, relax the neck muscles and deepen the breath into the abdomen. And now bend the left knee, hold the left, no, no, this is the right. Bend the left knee and hold the right foot, right toes with your right hand. Try pulling the left knee more up and the right knee is still straight. Just follow the instruction and whenever you're unable to follow the instruction, take a while, get up to watch the screen. Now release the left leg. Inhale, stretch your right leg up. As you exhale, bend the right knee to the chest. Press it into the chest. And the next breath, raise your right leg up. With control, exhale, bring the right leg down. Arms close to the body for the left side, repeating the same sequence. Lift your left leg up as you inhale, catch hold behind the left thigh with both your hands. Keep the knee straight. And on the exhalation, lift your head up, chest up, come up. Do whatever is possible, keep the knees straight. 
push the right thigh closer down to the mat, keeping both the legs equally active. Feel energy in the body, mindful practice, slow breathing. And slowly exhale, bring the head and chest down, bend the knee to the chest, the left knee to the chest, hug it tightly. And now hold the leg in your arms. Stay there. Pull the leg closer to the chest. Pankaj, please get up and watch the screen. Now lift your head up, chest up as you exhale, come up. Now hold the left foot with both your hands, push the left knee away from the body and try to move the left foot up towards the forehead or whatever you can do. Now slowly exhale, release the head and chest down, hold the left foot with your left toes with your left hand and stretch your left leg out to the left side. If the left knee bends, please hold the back of the left thigh instead of the foot. And now mindfully push the right buttock down towards the mat. Place your hand, uh, place your head at a comfortable position. Keep pushing the right body down. Relax the neck muscles. Now, as you inhale, bring the left leg up and change the position of your hands. With your right hand, pull the left leg down towards the right side, turn the head to the left, press the left shoulder down, and now bend the right knee, catch hold of the right foot with your right hand and pull the foot or and the knee up, more up. So the left knee is straight, and the right knee is bent and you're pulling the right foot up towards the body. Stretching the hamstring muscles of the left leg and the, feel the stretch in the frontal thigh of the right leg. Slowly release the right leg. Inhale, bring the left leg up. Exhale, bend the left knee to the chest, hug it tightly. And now when you're ready, release the left leg, stretch it up and exhale, bring it down. Take a breath, adjust your body for the double leg raises. You can very comfortably bring the arms under the body, hands under the buttocks, or you can place your arms close to the body or tuck the hands under the head. Double leg raises. Inhale, lift both your legs up Exhale, release the legs with control down. Keep the knees straight. Inhale, legs up. Exhale down. Inhale, third time up. We'll do six times. Exhale down. Inhale, up. Exhale down. Work with your abdomen, not with the neck or the shoulders. Fifth time up, inhale. Knees straight, push the heels out, exhale, bring the legs down with control. And one last time, inhale, come up. Slowly, as you exhale, bring the legs down. Bend the knees to the chest, hug the knees to the chest. And now place the feet on the mat, hip width apart, stretch your arms in line with the shoulders. As you exhale, Bring the knees down to the right, turn the head to the left and move the left foot up towards the left buttock. Push the left knee down with your right foot. Breathe. Inhale, slowly come up and bring the feet down on the mat. As you exhale, release the knees down to the left side and move the right foot more up towards the right buttock. Press the right thigh with your left foot. Breathe. When the knees drop to the left, head turns to the right. 
Keep your mind open. Keep your ears open, ready to do whatever is the instruction. Inhale, come up. Bring the knees to the chest. Press the lower back to the mat. Inhale, stretch your legs up. And exhale, lower the legs down. Give a long stretch to the body. We'll relax into the child's pose now. Stretch your whole body. Release the stretch. Bend the knees, turn over, and please sit up into the child's pose, Shashankasana. Mentally preparing for the Shishasan or the headstand practice. If you're unable to do the Shishasan, it's okay. You can either rest in Shavasana or you can do first few steps of headstand very safely. We'll demonstrate the first few steps on screen. If your head doesn't reach down after placing the buttocks on the heels, please make fist under the forehead, one on top of the other. And now please sit up. Let's get ready for the headstand practice, Shishasana. Sit up on the heels, hold the opposite elbows and place your forearms on the mat in front of the knees. Now stretch your arms forward, interlock your fingers. Lifting the buttocks up, place the top of the head on the mat and back of the head on the hands. Tuck the toes in and lift the knees up. Walk forward until the back feels straight. So you can stay here very comfortably if you are not able to come up into the headstand. This is a very safe position, getting most of the benefits of the headstand. Now moving further, bend the knees one by one to the chest and move the knees up towards the ceiling. And then when you're ready, straighten the legs up into headstand, Shishasana. Relax the body, the legs, and try not to put too much pressure on the head and the neck. Push your body down on the tripod, tripod, the forearms and the elbows. Keep the abdomen tucked in towards the spine. and hold here comfortably. Any discomfort, any time, don't wait for my instruction. You can follow the steps and come out of the pose. And now it's time to come out, bend the knees, bring the knees to the chest and release the feet down. Relax into the child's pose, Shashankasana. Please sit up and lie down on your back in Shavasana. Arms apart, legs apart, turn the head side to side. Relax.
Take a deep breath, bring your legs together, interlock your hands up over the head, stretch your whole body. Release the stretch, get ready for the shoulder stand cycle. Arms close to the body, palms facing down, feet together, toes pointing up, chin tucking in towards the chest. Inhale, lift both your legs up. Exhale, swing the trunk up and support your back into the shoulder stand. Stay there for a few breaths before you start adjusting the body. And now to adjust, bend the knees to the forehead. Try to walk your hands towards the middle back, adjusting the shoulders, adjusting the arms. When you're ready, lift your legs up again. Once you're there, push the buttocks towards the head and try to align your heels, the buttocks and the shoulders. As the name is shoulder stand, shifting the body weight entirely to the shoulders. But remember, if the neck is not good, keep the weight distributed on the elbows and the shoulders. So your legs will be slightly tilted in order to adjust the body. Consciously relaxing the legs. Relax the whole body, close your eyes. Lifting up a little higher up with the inhalation. Adjust your body, adjust your hands. <clears throat> Get ready for the variations in halasana. Exhale, release the right leg with control over the head. Inhale, the right leg up. Exhale, the left leg over the head. Inhale, the left leg up. Now, <clears throat> Bend the left knee and place the left foot across the right thigh in half lotus. Inhale, and as you exhale with control, bring the right leg down. And remember to listen to your body. It puts tremendous pressure on the neck. Go as far down as is good for you. Push the left knee away from the body. Inhale, the right leg up. Interchange your legs. And on the exhalation, bring the left leg down. Move the right knee away from the body. Inhale the left leg up. Stretch both your legs up, adjust your body. And on the exhalation, bring both the legs over the head with control. Halas in the plow pose. If the toes touch down, please release the arms on the mat. You can interlock the fingers or just keep the arms down. Push the knees away from the forehead. And if you are not comfortable, if it's your first day, if you're not okay, you can bend the knees to the forehead and keep your back supported. Take rest in this posture instead of doing the complete posture. Deepen the breath into the abdomen, stimulating the abdominal organs. Lift the tailbone more up by shifting the body weight entirely towards the shoulders. Each vertebra opening as you move the tailbone more up towards the ceiling. Now support your back, 
releasing the posture inhale come up into the shoulder stand you can either use your arms as breaks release the legs over the head and come down or you can move into the setu bandhasan so if you are releasing the posture please go slow and come down without any jerk and if you are moving to setu bandhasan then also do not jerk the spine everybody up into the setu bandhasan bend the knees hold your ankles or you can keep the arms close to the body by the side inhale lift your buttocks up and come up imagine a cushion between your knees and the thighs squeeze that cushion work on the quadriceps along with the spine stay up breathe chest is close to the chin the entire series working on the thyroid and the parathyroid glands feel a good arch in your back and slowly exhale come down place your hands under the shoulders fingers turn inwards preparing for chakrasana inhale lift your body up and come up the wheel pose press the hands to straighten your arms stay up breathe hold 10 9 Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Try to lift your right leg up if you can. Okay. <clears throat> Slowly exhale. Bring the body down. Bend the knees to the chest. Hug it tightly. And on the exhalation, lift your head up, chest up, come up. Make a tight, small energy ball with your body, with the chin, nose, or forehead stretching towards the knees and back pressing down. Every day, the body behaves differently. Practice is different. Keep breathing, and slowly as you exhale, bring the head down, chest down. Inhale, stretch your legs up. and exhale gently release down matsyasan the fish pose your arms tucked under the body elbows closely hidden under the body and the hands stretch down feet are together inhale head up chest up come up on your elbows and look to the toes as you exhale lift your chest arch your back and release the top of the head on the mat chest is wide open so make use of the full lung capacity the effortless slow and deep breath after every inhalation pause for a while and after every exhalation pause for a while most of the body weight is on your elbows So any time the head is under too much pressure you need to press on the elbows inhale bring your head up chest up come up on the elbows and look to the toes as you exhale bring the body down release your arms from under the body make fist around the thumbs rotate the wrist clockwise and anti clockwise turn the head side to side take rest relax into shavasana let's now make it supta bad konasan so keep the arms where they are bend the knees join the soles together and adjust your feet to a comfortable position allowing the knees to drop down keep the breath active
Now stretch your legs out. Take a deep breath. Interlock your fingers, stretch your arms over the head and stretch the whole body. Let's now sit up in Nakasan. Release the hands. Inhale, lift your legs up, head up, chest up. Point the fingers to the feet and come up. Keep the abdominal muscles tight and neck muscles relaxed. Hold 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and sit up. Join the soles together for the butterfly. Sit up straight, hold the toes and flap your knees, your chin parallel to the floor, shoulders away from the ears. Now stretch both your legs out. No, legs are together. Keep the legs together. And now bend the left knee, place the left foot across the right thigh. And lift your right leg up. You need to lean a little back in order to lift that leg up. Right leg up, just try it. We are doing it for the first time on screen, hold the back of the leg. Yeah. And now try to straighten your back, make it vertical. Sit up straight. It's not possible. Okay, let's do the Janushi Shasan. Release it. Keep the left foot touching the right thigh. Inhale, stretch your arms up, stretch the whole body. <clears throat> and as you exhale, stretch your body forward and come down. Hold the leg comfortably wherever you can. Very important to relax. So at center the chest, your chest parallel to the thigh and relax the left shoulder away from the ear. You can hold wherever your body allows. Keep breathing deeply into the abdomen. And now keep holding the right foot with your right hand, wherever your hand is, just be there. Move the left knee a little more away from the body. Parivrita Janu Shishasan. And twist your body, open the chest up. Hold the, yeah, okay. So you're twisting the body, opening the chest up. Breathe. You can also place your uh, right hand on the left knee. So holding the left knee with your right hand and twisting the body. Keep the left elbow straight. Whether or not you can reach up to the toes, it's fine. But keep the elbow straight. Inhale, slowly come up. And release your arms, exhale. Interchange your legs. Stretching the left leg out and bend the right knee. Right foot touching the left thigh. Inhale, stretch your arms up. And as you exhale, stretch forward and down on the left leg. Janu Shishasan. Keep the elbows bent. If you're not able to come down, just relax with your breath wherever possible. Relax the shoulders and relax the neck. And now twisting the body, moving the right knee more away, open up into the 
Parivrit Janu Shishasan. Opening the chest up. Your right arm from over the right ear is holding the right toes or just stretching away with elbow straight. Inhale, slowly come up and exhale, release your arms. Stretch both your legs out for Paschimottanasana. Sit up straight from the lower back. Stretch your arms up, inhale, lengthen up your spine. And on the exhalation, stretch your body forward and come down. Stretching from the lower back, bending from the buttocks, from the waist and holding wherever possible. Go with the breath, leaving all the struggle behind. Relax the shoulders, relax the neck and relax the spine. Stretch from the lower back, middle back, upper back. Deepen the breath into the abdomen. Now, as you inhale, stretch your body forward and stretch up. Exhale, bring the hands behind, fingers away from the body, drop the head back. Inhale, lift your body up and come up. Inclined plane, Purvottanasana. Stay up for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and come down. Relax on your abdomen. Make a pillow with your hands. Turn the head to the right. Big toes touching, heels fall apart. Mentally preparing for the back foot bends. Breathe into the abdomen, recharging the body. Now get ready for the first backward bend Bhujangasana. Bring your feet together, forehead resting down, elbows close to the chest, hands under the shoulders. Inhale, lift your head up, chest up and come up. Cobra Bhujangasana. Lift your upper body more up and press on the lower abdomen. Relax the shoulders, relax the neck and breathe. Slowly, as you exhale, bring the body down, turn the head to the other side, make a pillow and relax. Shalab Asan, the locust. Stretch your chin forward, your arms tucked under the body, elbows hidden under the body. You can interlock the fingers, you can make fist around the thumbs, or you can place the hands on the mat. Feet together, toes pointing back. Inhale, lift your right leg up, Ardha Shalabhasana. Do not twist the buttocks. Keep the knee straight. Exhale, right leg down. Left leg up, inhale. Exhale, down. Right leg up, inhale. Support the right thigh with your left foot. 
hold and breathe. And slowly release the support, exhale, release the right leg down. Left leg up, inhale, support the left thigh with your right foot. Feel the body weight shift towards the chin. Slowly release the support, exhale, release the leg down. Take two breaths, adjust the body, relax the body, gather all your energy in your arms. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale. Now, inhale, lift both your legs up, come up into Shalabhasana, the locust pose. Stay up, hold 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and come down. Release your arms from under the body, turn the head to one side, take rest, relax. The last back to bend, the Nurasan, the bow pose, forehead down, bend the knees, hold your ankles. Inhale, lift the knees up, thighs up, let the head and chest pull up, come up. Stretch the chin up, keep the elbow straight and try to lift the legs more up. Come up on the soft part of your abdomen, hold and breathe. Relax the face, relax the jaw. Stay up. Hold 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, high up, 4, Three, two, one. Slowly come down. Head to the other side. Take a moment. Relax. Now place your hands under the shoulders. Give a good stretch to the body. Coming up on the knees and the hands. For the cat cow stretch, inhale, stretch your chin up, push your buttocks back, arch your back. Exhale, squeeze it, squeeze the uh, abdomen and bring the chin in. Inhale, stretch, chin forward, push the hip back, arch your back. Exhale, around the back, tuck the chin towards the chest and abdomen towards the spine. Inhale back to the neutral position and please stretch back into the child's pose, Shashankasan. You can stretch your arms forward, knees apart, bring the chest down, forehead or chin down. The wide angle extended child pose, sitting between the heels, big toes are touching. And slowly come up, sit up. Join the knees together for the half spinal twist at the Masindrasan. Drop the body down to the right side. Bring the left foot across the right thigh. Place the left hand near the tailbone on the mat. Right arm up, inhale, lengthen up your body. And as you exhale, twist to the left, open the chest. And lean forward, push the left knee with your upper right arm. Catch hold of your ankle or just hug the knee. Close your eyes, stretch the chin beyond the left shoulder and breathe. Both the sitting bones are resting down. 
shoulders are in one line. If you feel the right shoulder is hunched, you can move the left foot just a little forward. Feel a good pressure on the abdomen. Inhale, lift your right arm up and exhale, release. Change the side. Sit on the left, bring the right foot across the left thigh, place the right hand behind near the tailbone, stretch your left arm up, inhale, lengthen up. Exhale, twist your body to the right, lean forward and try to hold the ankle or hug the knee, whichever is good for you. Look to the right shoulder. Keep breathing. Close your eyes. Inhale, bring your left arm up. Exhale, release it down. Bring both the knees to the chest, hug the knees tightly. Let's now get ready for the Crow Kakasan. Come up into the squatting position, making a rough square with your hands and feet. Fingers slightly open, hands turned inwards. Look at a point in front. Get a good grip of the knees and the upper arms. Shift your body weight forward from feet to the hands. And only if you're ready, lift one foot up and the other foot up into the crow kakasana. Try it again. That's very good. Please release and stand up. Standing forward bend, bring your feet together. Inhale, stretch your arms up. And as you exhale, stretch your body forward and come down. Hold behind the legs, either the back of the thighs or reach up to the ankles. Shift your body weight forward from heels towards the toes, evenly spreading towards the toes. Bring the chest close to the thighs and forehead close to the knees. Watch your neck, watch your shoulders. Try not to hold any tension. Allow the free flow of blood towards the head. Keep the knees straight wherever you may hold. Feel a good stretch in the hamstrings. Now to release, soften the knees. Dangle your arms loose, keep the chin tucking into the chest, one vertebra at a time, come up. Count a stretch to the body, feet hip distance apart, support your back, drop the head back and push the buttocks forward, breathe here. Knees are straight. And slowly come up. Now, using the length of the mat, Separate the legs apart for Trikonasan. Turn the right foot at 90 degrees to the left and left foot slightly inwards. Your buttocks are facing forward. Stretch your left arm up as you inhale, lengthen up your left side and exhale, bend down to the right side. Right hand slides down the right leg. Feel a good stretch in the left side of the body. You can look in front or turn the head to look up. Keep breathing. And now bend the right knee. Bend the right knee, place the right elbow on the Thigh, right thigh. Left elbow is a straight. And now move the right hand by the side of the right foot. 
Place it down on the mat. Stay there. Keep the chest, lift it up. Don't drop the head down. The right knee hugging the right shoulder and the right shoulder pushing against the right thigh. Now go step by step to come out. First come up to place the elbow, the right elbow on the thigh and then come up into Trikonasana. Inhale and come up, inhale. Slowly exhale, release the arm down. Change the side. Turn the left foot out and right foot in. Stretch your right arm up as you inhale. Exhale, bend down to the left side. Allow the left hand to slide down the left leg without leaning forward. Keep the right elbow straight. Look in front or look to the top. Adjust your body to be more comfortable. So remember your buttocks are facing forward, chest is lifted up and your right arm is just a little over the ear, uh, behind the ear, so that you don't bend forward. And now bend the left knee, place the left elbow on the left thigh and feel a good stretch in the right side, right elbow straight. Now place the left hand down by the side of the left foot and breathe. The left knee and the shoulder hugging, left shoulder pressing against the knee. And now coming up, following the steps, come up first, place the elbow on the thigh and then come up into Trikonasana by straightening the knee. Inhale, lift your Lift yourself up, exhale, release the arm down. Join the legs together. Come to the top of the mat. Time for final relaxation. Please do not leave the class. We do the pranam practice after this. Please sit down and lie down on your back in Shavasana. Take a while, slow down the breath. And now let's do the physical relaxation of the body parts. Lift the right leg two inches off the mat, tense the right leg and drop it down. Left leg up two inches, tense the leg and drop it down. Lift the buttocks up, squeeze them tight up and drop down. Press the load back into the mat. Release, lift your chest up and drop it down. Lift your arms two inches up, clench your fingers tight, tight, and open the fingers, tense your arms, tense, and drop down. Squeeze the shoulders into the ears, and relax. Tighten all the facial muscles towards the nose. Let go. Open your mouth wide, pull your tongue out. Open your eyes wide and stretch all the facial muscles. Relax, close your mouth. Move the shoulders down and gently turn the head to the right. Turn the head to the left. Back to the center. Make any final adjustment you have to. For the next seven to eight minutes, we'll completely still the body. So adjust your body now. Make your legs comfortably apart with feet falling to the sides. Shoulders away from the ears, arms six to eight inches away from the body, palms facing up. Bring the chin in towards the chest. And mentally scan the body once again from toes to the head. Any tightness, let go. Watch your buttocks. If you're holding tightness there, please let go. Now 
Now let's relax the body mentally without moving any part of the body. Relax the toes, relax the soles, the heels and the ankles. Relax the shins and the calves. Relax the knees and the thighs. Relax the buttocks. Relax the hip joint. The legs are completely relaxed. Relax the abdomen. Relax the chest. Bring the awareness to your back. Relax the lower back. Middle back. Upper back. Relax the spinal column. Relax. Back is completely relaxed. Bring the awareness to your arms. Relaxing the fingers, the palms and the wrist. Relax the forearms. Elbows and the upper arms. Relax the shoulders. Relax the shoulder blades. The arms and the shoulders are completely relaxed. Relax the neck, the back of the head, top of the head. Relax the forehead, the eyes, the ears. Relax the cheekbones, the nostrils, the jaw. Relax the tongue and the throat. The neck head and the face are completely relaxed. Relax. Move the awareness deeper to the internal organs in the body. Or to suggest each organ in the abdomen to relax. Relax. Relax the lungs. Relax the heart and the brain. All the internal organs in the body are relaxed. Bring the awareness to your mind. Let go of the thoughts. Relax the mind. Relax the mind. Relax. Mind is relaxed. Body is completely relaxed. Mind is relaxed. Breath is relaxed. Relax. Relax, relax.
Bring the awareness back to your body. Move the toes, move the fingers. Check out your legs, check out your arms. Gently turn the head side to side. Breathe more consciously. Bring your legs together. Interlock your hands. Stretch your arms over the head. Stretch your whole body. Release the stretch. Take your time. Bend the knees. Turn over to one side. And when you feel ready, please sit up. <clears throat> Let's get ready for the practice of Kapalabhati. So if you need a cushion, please use a cushion. Sit up straight, comfortable cross legged position, both the hands on your knees in chin mudra. Let's take two deep breaths. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. The first round of Kapalabhati. Inhale deeply. And begin. One, two, 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 one two 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 one
normal breathing now bring your awareness at the third eye center and get ready to hold the breath relax your face relax the whole body inhale three quarters of your lungs gently hold the breath Slowly with control, exhale, inhale, and exhale. The next round of Kapalabhati. Inhale deeply and again. One, 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 one. One, 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 Exhale, relax, normal breathing. Relax the shoulders, relax the neck. Lift your spine from the base. Chin parallel to the mat, face relaxed, jaw relaxed. Relax the forehead and the eyes. Let's now get ready to hold the breath. Inhale three, fourth of your lungs. Gently retain the breath. Focus at the third eye center and mentally repeat your personal mantra or the universal mantra OM. Slowly with control, exhale, inhale, exhale. Now get ready for the alternate nostril breathing. Your right hand in Vishnu Mudra, left hand in Chen Mudra. Keep your back straight through both the nostrils. Take a deep breath, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, block the right nostril with your right thumb, left inhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, hold the breath, close the nostrils, awareness at the third eye center, mentally repeat your mantra. Right exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale right on one, on two, on three, on four. Retain the breath. Close the nostrils. Now 
Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold, close the nostrils. Right exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale right on one, on two, on three, on four, retain. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four. Retain the breath, close the nostrils. Relax the body. Relax the mind. Right, exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right on one, on two, on three, on four, hold, close the nostrils. Left exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four, hold, close the nostrils. Spine is straight, body relaxed, mind focused. Right exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale right on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath, close the nostrils. Relax the facial muscles. Relax the forehead, your eyes, the jaw. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale left on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold gently. Right exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale right on one, on two, on three, on four. Gently hold. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four, retain the breath. Watch your mind, become aware of your mind. Any thought, let go, concentrate on your mantra. Right, exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale right on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath. This is the last breath retention. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Bring the hand down. Put the hands on your knees in chin mudra. Relax the body, normal, gentle breathing. And let's now wind up the class with the final prayer. Oh, 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 oh,
लोकम यचामहे सुगंधिम पुष्टिवर्धनम उर्वाकमेव बंधना मृत्योर् मुक्षेयृता ओं त्रयंबक यचामहे सुगंधि पुष्टिवर्धनम उर्वाकमेव बंधना मृत्योर् मुक्षेयृता ओं त्रयंबक यचामहे सुगंधि पुष्टिवर्धनम उर्वाकमेव बंधना मृत्योर् मुक्षेयृता मंगल सुखिन सर्वे सन्त निरामया सर्वे भद्रा पश्य दुखभागवे असत मदगमया तम सोमाज्योतिर्गमया मृत्योर्मातंगमया ओं पूर्णमता पूर्णमद पूर्णा पूर्णा मुदर्च्य पूर्ण से पूर्णमादा पूर्णमेवशिष्य ओ शाति 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 थैंक्स टू अवर मास्टर्स हरि ओम तत्सन थैंक यू एवरीवन